Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and thank you for watching. Happy New Year to all of you. Yes, this is my first video in this new year and I'm so excited to create this look for you. I wanted to do something which is more sultry and smoky and I got my hands on something really great from Morphe so I thought why not to give it a try. Also, I got some amazing lip glazes from Iris and I really wanted to try them out and show you how beautiful do they look like when you put it on. So in case you want to see how did I create this look, keep on watching. But wait, before you go and watch my video, let me tell you that we have a giveaway in this video as well. And all that you need to do to win the giveaway is, I'll let you know in the end. I will start by priming my face and for my primer today I'm using the Too Faced Hangover Primer. It's a beautiful primer with coconut water and is very very nice and hydrating on skin. I love this one especially for winters and it makes the skin quite hydrated. For my foundation today I'm using the Perfection Lumiere foundation from Chanel. It's, it's a nice full coverage foundation and I'm going to apply it using my damp beauty blender. I'm using this one from Too Faced which is Bone This Way. It's a multi-use sculpting concealer and is super coverage. This one is in the shade Natural Beige and after Tarte Shade Tape Concealer, I think this one is going to be my favorite because it's extremely full coverage. face I'm using the NARS soft matte complete concealer in the shade custard and I am going to apply it on all the high points of my face I am going to blend all this using the damp beauty blender under eye area I am using the illuminating setting powder in the shade light from cover effects I will apply it again using the same damp beauty blender under my eyes around my mouth the center of the forehead and also on the jawline just to make my contour look a little more prominent I am going to do my contour using this Too Faced chocolate gold bronzer and I am using it with the Luxie brush. It's a large angled brush 504. This bronzer has beautiful sheen to it and I really like it especially for creating this look.
for my nose contour I'm using the Luxie brush 207 it's a nice slant brush and works very well for nose contour Now it's time to add some blush and I am applying this blush from Benefit which is Sugar Bomb and I'm applying it with the powder and the blush brush from Sigma which is F10. For my highlighter today I am using this stunning highlighter from Colourpop which is a super shock cheek highlighter in the shade Wisp and oh my god. Can we take a moment and look at the highlight? It's so stunning and it just melts into your skin. Love you Colourpop for giving us such beautiful highlighters and such beautiful eyeshadows. I love them. I am going to do my brows off camera and will be right back. I am done with my brows and I have already primed my eyes. Now it's time to start with the eyes. I am using this long wear eye pencil from Faces in the shade Smog and I am going to apply it just on half of the lid. I am sort of creating smoky eyes so I want something, some sort of base where my eyeshadow can stick well. So I am using this pencil from Faces with this MAC brush 217. I will blend it pretty nicely till the transition area. And now for my eyes today, I'm using the Chocolate Gold Palette from Too Faced. The first color that I'm using is the Cocoa Truffle color with this Luxie Brush 227 and I will apply it as my transition color. The next shade that I'm using is this one which is Tessident with this Morphe brush E36 and I will just apply it on the outer corner of the eyes. I will apply the color in the form of V and then by using the same brush, I am going to blend both the colors together. Now it's time for the main lid color and I'm using this Hola for a dollar. <laughs> Such a beautiful name with this crown brush which is C210 and I am going to dip my brush in MAC Fix Plus and then dip it into the same color and apply it all over the lid. This color is so so beautiful. It's nice green that adds a touch of smokiness also into it and some nice specks of gold glitter can also be seen. But to make my eyeshadow pop all the more, I so wanted to try this Morphe metallic eyeshadow and this is in the shade Ignite. I am going to apply this all over the lid on top of this green shadow and blend it. And look how stunning these metallic eyeshadows look. Now to highlight, I am using a nice pencil brush and I'm going to highlight with this beautiful color here which is gold dipped and I'm going to highlight my inner corner because I want my inner corner to pop all the more and I'm going to highlight my brow bone as well using the same color. I really want to fill my lash line and for that I'm using the perfect black from Too Faced. It's a waterproof eyeliner and I'm going to tight line my upper lash and lower lash line with the same. For my mascara I'm using the Bad Girl Bank Mascara from Benefit. I'm going to apply it on my upper and lower lashes. I think I am good to go like this, but if you want to add lashes, you can very well add lashes on top of this.
Now I'm going to blend all of this together so that everything looks nice and blended. And I love this Kiko brush for doing this. And in the end, I am going to apply my lip color. I am outlining my lips with this Boldly Bare Lip Liner from MAC. And I am going to fill my lips with this lip glaze, which is just introduced by Hyris. And the one that I'm applying today is in the shade Princess. They are so beautiful. She has lost seven different colors in this and I love each one of them. They feel so moisturizing on your lips, not at all drying and they are not at all gloopy. Even if you wear it for a longer time, it stays intact on your lips. And during this winter season, I, I think they are perfect. So I think that's a wrap up for the video and I actually loved how beautiful this look turned out. And I completely loved the formula for these metallic eyeshadows from Morphe. It, it turned out so beautiful. I completely loved it. In case you like the video, please do not forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to win the giveaway, all that you need to do is like my video, subscribe to my channel, comment on my video and hit the notification bell so that you are notified every time I upload. We will be announcing the winners after 24 hours and I am going to post it on my Insta story as well. All the products that you can see on the screen now are the ones that you can win in this giveaway. All the best, stay blessed, keep watching and happy new year to all of you again.